All right. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Shots Fired, the best marathon of the century. Uh, we're starting off with Mortier 4, Operation Thunderstorm, which is a fantastic game made by the also famous Polish studio City Interactive. Uh, it's a pretty fast paced speedrun. I'll be talking through most of it. So get ready. Uh, time will start whenever I press any key to continue. So three, two, one, go. All right. So first thing I'm doing is a save warp, which is uh, basically this game runs on the fear engine. So whenever the game saves, it freezes. And uh, in that freeze, you can buffer more Slowly. actions. So I buffer another save and a load at the same time, which for some reason quicker. puts you in a default location on the map. And then you can carry momentum from that lo hmm. from the previous location you warped from window. into the new location. So we use that a bunch throughout the run to skip big portions of the game. And then the rest is just basic running, gunning. Shooting Nazis, all that good stuff. So on this level I will not be save warping because it just puts you too far out of bounds to make it back to the level. But it's it's fine, don't worry about it. We have a bunch of different tech to help us Machine go fast, gun. like tree out of bounds. Where you climb a tree and you go out of bounds because collision is hard. Don't worry about it. So this is just like Extended out of bounds sequence. I'm gonna quick save here because this jump is pretty tricky. Typical. <laughs> Sorry about that. Alright, so uh, we're just gonna kill a bunch of these guys, so you have to kill all of these to open this gate, and here's the end of the level, very nice. There are shots being fired indeed. So another save warp here to skip like half the level. And here I'll be picking up another gun. This is the best gun in the game. I don't know its name because don't worry about it. I just doesn't matter. But uh, another big thing about uh, this game is uh, just like in fear, different guns have different run speeds. So obviously you want to optimize what you're run what you're holding when running to go fastest to go the fastest. And so I'll be using the Sten and the other gun I just picked up. For the most part. There is a part where I'll be using a different gun. But uh it's, uh, it's a bit slower. I'll be using the MP40 for like one part of the run. It's a bit slower but it's a lot safer, so I'll take that. Here's a bit of an RNG strat. Those guys can die to the grenade or not. They did. So if you kill those guys, this door opens that I just went through. So obviously killing them with the grenade is faster than... Uh, than going over there and shooting them. What? How did I die? Oh no! What happened? <laughs> okay. Uh... Guess we're doing that again. Excuse me? Uh... Hmm... Okay, we're doing... <laughs> nice! Oh, this is going as well as I could have hoped for. Fantastic. <laughs> okay. So, uh... I guess... I, I guess this is a marathon, so uh... That's never happened before saying those cursed words right away. 
Very cool. Super cool, even. Okay. <laughs> Unbelievable. Alright. This is another glitch that's, that we just stole from the Fear Speedrun. Uh, called melee cancelling or punch cancelling or whatever you want to call it. Uh, when you melee, you can crouch to sort of reset the animation and just start another one. And uh, yeah, let's you do like five melees in a second. It's pretty good. But okay. Grab the keys again. Gonna make a quick save. <laughs> Can't believe that happened. What was that? Okay. Nice. This, uh... Let's just get out of this level, please. Thank you, okay. Gonna make another quick save, just in case. But coming up here is a boss fight. It's pretty hard, so I'm gonna have to focus. It's the boss, and... Okay, got it. Ooh! That was close. Alright. So moving on, that was basically a third of the game. Now I'll be doing another save work on this level. And this is a bit of a slower a route. Nightmare. But it shows off a pretty good cutscene, so I just want everyone to witness the amazing voice acting in this game. Thank you. You saved our lives. Make your way out of these tunnels. I can't take you with me. Gotcha. But watch your back. There are Germans all over the place. I will. Very good. So now we're just gonna be running through here, trying not to die. I don't know. We just do. Don't worry about it. There's just more your things. Oh yeah, I guess another uh, another trick that I've been doing throughout the run, but haven't mentioned is reload cancelling. So. When you have zero ammo in your current clip, you can switch weapons to reload instantly. I am having an amazing day. I'm starting off this great marathon with a fantastic video game. So this is High Noon. Shoutouts to Suicide Machine for finding this. You can just sort of go up here and uh, yeah, skip the whole level. Hit the trigger over there. And right at the end, there we go. Very nice. Yep, accidentally found it. So this is the part I'll be using the MP40. Uh, basically just for this room and the one coming up. But this is a pretty interesting skip. So this door usually closes and like a plank spawns behind it Someone's to lock it, door. but I'll if you throw a grenade and then save load, uh, you just break the plank, and uh, it's fine, don't worry about it. Stop it. Okay. Shoutouts to suicide. Okay, I said suicide machine, okay? Okay, so coming up is a pretty annoying room, there's a large combat sequence here, it's pretty long, pretty annoying, uh, just kidding, we're gonna... Slide under this. Oh no! I actually have to reload that. <laughs> he broke the box. He's not supposed to do that. <laughs> what? <laughs> this run is cursed. Okay, don't break the box this time, thank you. So here I, I'm just doing a bit of platforming to skip some enemy spawns. <laughs> wow, this this is a run of firsts, obviously. How did all of this happen? <laughs> okay. Oh. 
Uh, so here we just grab the key and we'll go down grenades. Very nice. So this used to be a pretty annoying part of the run, then I realized you could just run through it. Uh, it's not anymore. Very cool. And here's some fight optimizations. So first we need to kill a bunch of these guys, which can just throw a grenade. Wow. Very good. No more the fantastic up, my friend. voice acting. I'll personally cut your throat. Get him. Catch the bastard. Very nice. And now we throw two grenades to the left, which yep. should kill the two enemies on the left, and then the two on the right will just run towards me. So that's a very nice. Fight optimization, and here's the second boss. Got him, very nice. And alright, so this is the last like part of the run, the last sort of segment. Last three levels, basically. Uh, this level has a fairly new out of bounds, which. I hope I can get pretty quickly. I'm still not the best at it because uh, it's fairly new, but let's see, yeah, this jump is really precise. Oh, come on. There we go, got it. Very nice. So now we're technically out of bounds, but not in a very useful out of bounds. But now we can just jump over here and sort of see him walk on the edge of the map and make it to this room super early. Sehr gut, yeah. Damn good fireworks. Don't worry about that guy. He always does that. Okay, so here we have button warp, where we use the button from below, and we warp to it. It's amazing how much tech this game has. Truly revolutionary. Damn good fireworks, exactly. Uh, okay. This is scary. Right, so this explosion usually kills you, but standing in this corner, it doesn't reach you, I guess? I, I don't know. Don't worry about it. And yeah, that was the factory. So, two more levels left, and uh, we're at the end of the other level, so... What's that smell? I think good. I found more crowds over here. It's, uh, it's the first save warp that was found to be useful before, uh, before we realized that you could carry momentum through them. And yeah, this level sucks, so I'm glad we skip it. Cause, uh... Yeah, what's that smell? It's blood. I see. Okay. Last level of the game. If someone uh, finds an out of bounds for this level, I will give you my entire PayPal account. I'm sure you could benefit from those, like, five bucks. But, uh, yeah. Please break this level. It's awful. Be ready, boy. Be ready, boy. Okay. More shots being fired all over the place. You know how it is. Yeah, sorry. I mean, it could be yours. Just find a consistent number of bounds for this area. Here's a funny jump. Like so, skips three enemies spawning here. Uh, very useful. Worth pointing out. And here's box jump, where you know three out of bounds. 
Well, the name should be pretty self-explanatory. I, uh, I shot one too many times. The physics in this game are special, to say the least. Okay. Oh, please jump. <laughs> oh my god. Impossible. Just kidding. It's actually free. Yeah, obviously, shooting shooting a gun at like a wooden box doesn't break it, just pushes it. Obviously. Okay, so coming up here is another pretty funny glitch. It's very unfortunate that we don't get to use it more, but... Oh, well. I can actually aim. So we hit that. Set up for a hopefully triple kill. Unpossible. There we go, nice. And we do what's called ladder float or air walk or whatever. Every trick in this game has like five different names. But basically, I hold jump, I spam use and crouch on the ladder, and now I can fly. So I'll use that. To skip lowering this bridge thing. And gonna save out here to get rid of it. Because while you're floating your accuracy is decreased. Shoutouts to this cutscene. Uh, they didn't know how to make the camera change angle in the engine. So they just made two cutscenes and put them one right after the other. So when you skip them, uh, when you skip one cutscene, the other plays like after the time of the first one has passed. Very good. So here's just a staircase behind a wall. Don't worry about it. So uh, yeah, perfectly fine. And this is the last room of the game, so we just have to kill these guys. It's very easy to die here, so I want to be kind of careful. But we should be fine. Should be two more enemies. Okay, that's one. The oh other is God. just sitting here. All right. Was war das? That guy just didn't spawn. Cool. Okay, it's time to move now. It's time to move now. Oh, get ready on time, by the way. Time is when the screen fades, which is now. Time. Oh, that was certainly a run of firsts. Uh, but yeah, we, we stopped the Nazis, we killed a bunch of big Nazi figures or something. I, I don't know, things happened. Uh, hope it was enjoyable. If you have any questions about the game or would like to learn the run, which I'm sure you don't, but I'm, I'm saying just in case you do, uh, feel free to hit me up on Discord. There's the Border Discord linked on the speedrun.com page. Yeah, go wild. Next up is uh, The Thing by Matt Matt. So look forward to that. And yeah, stick around. Marathon's good.